there's a change in immigration policy at the Nogales Port of Entry to start this new year. And it all has to do with the controversial migrant protection protocols or the return to Mexico policy. News 4 Tucson's Eric Fink joins us live along the border in Nogales with more on this story. Good evening, Eric. Good evening here at the border, John. So when Border Patrol and Customs and Border Protection pick up asylum seekers or migrants here at the Nog Nogales port of entry, that will become the latest port, according to this new policy, under the Trump administration's MPP or return to Mexico policy, meaning that those migrants picked up will go across to Nogales, Sonora to wait for their court hearings in the U.S. Now that is a change. Prior to today, the migrants and asylum seekers who were picked up for MPP here had to be bused to El Paso and then dropped off in Ciudad Juarez. Now those migrants and asylum seekers will head back across the border to the Sonora side. Department of Homeland Security officials say the return to Mexico policy has been effective in dealing with the humanitarian and security crisis at the border by reducing human smuggling. But the sheriff of Santa Cruz County says this will only make a long process more difficult. They're going to have to be settling in Nogales, Mexico, possibly for an extended period of time. In that time, obviously, do they have the resources over there? Uh, be mindful that, uh, that Mexico is a third world country. I, I think that returning them to Mexico, it's really a hardship for a lot of these people. And we're back out here live tonight at the Nogales Port of Entry, the Deconcini Port of Entry. We're going to have a lot more on this policy change about how it affects this part of our southern border coming up tonight on News 4 Tucson at 10 o'clock. Live for now in Nogales tonight, I'm Eric Fink, News 4 Tucson. John, let's send things back to you. Eric, thank you. Amanda